Get us underway in the second group in the pairs free. It's a couple that finished sixth in US Nationals last year, but they've done really, really well in a couple of the Challenger Series events this year. Finished second in Barry, second in Salt Lake City. They go into this free, lying in fourth place. This is Marissa Castelli and Mervyn Tran for the USA, and they've got a medley by Journey. Sensational start, triple twist. through the lift, lovely set up to the single arm. Oh, just got the timing wrong on the Salcos. First mistake so far. Throw triple salco. Love it. Great setup for the spin. Throw double axle, you don't see that very often. It's a difficult one to control, and you can see she was unable to do that.
Well, that was a power-packed program. Shakes his head. He knows it uh, wasn't anything like they can do. Too many mistakes in the program. The technical score is creeping up, but uh, that was a tough one. I think they'll be a little disappointed with that. If the jumps had been there, it would be a totally different picture yeah. because the rest of it had some fine quality in it. The, um, his presentation of his partner, he should have it because he's got the experience, of course, being up there at the top of the world, but it really is distinctive and excellent the way that he relates to Marissa, presents her, the, and how he connects the movements and stays in touch with her. It's a joy to watch. Loads of power, loads of attack. The lifts are very difficult and well done. Yeah, the problem they're going to have is that they made the mistakes on the jumps and the, the throws that they had weren't the most difficult ones, the double axle and the, the throw triple sow, carrying the, the lowest tariff. These two uh, both skated with different partners. In fact, Mervyn here, he was a bronze medalist in the World Championships with Narumi Takahashi. Remember that back in 2012? Marissa, twice U.S. national champion, competed in Sochi with Simon Schnappier. And it's, it's exciting, isn't it? I, I think it's exciting to see them together. When the things are not going quite right, you think, when it all does click. Yeah. There's the power Hello, there and that relationship. Michael. Different dynamic. It's, Good luck, everyone. It's great. Yeah, again, it could be a, a work in progress for these two. Yeah, I think it's getting better. Just a matter of doing. Yeah. Yeah. So sweaty. Jenny and Dave, I don't Too much information. Yeah. <laughs> but it's you, okay. <laughs> you really do sense that uh, it is a work in progress and they're going to get better and better. Certainly as the season goes on. There's blood. So where will they have them? And maybe they should clean the blood off the ice. <laughs> 94.31 would give them the lead. Anything uh, above that, and I'm pretty sure they're going to do that. <laughs> got a season's best of 109.22. <laughs> Gremlins creeping into the system. <laughs> it's the Russians lead, leading at the moment, Bazarova. And Deputant with 156.15. We should start a slow clap. The pre program score 111.5. Yeah. So they go into the lead. Season's best, they'll take that. Good second score, 57.59. That's not bad at all. It reflects that relationship between them that they've got the speed and the, all the elements in the presentation working well. And more to come from that.